Hello everybody, Ginger Show here, and welcome back to Naruto Mod Pack Survival Thingy. First of all, apologies for the episode being a bit later today because, well, I was doing the Dragon Block Sea World Tournament event thing. That was, it was really fun. <laughs> it was really good. I can't wait to upload the footage for it. Um, it was just one fight for the preliminaries, and then the main tournament itself will be next week. But for the preliminaries, um, there's four fights today, there's another four fights tomorrow. And my fight was second. Following that player two off this server, he was fighting through all living craft. It was brilliant. I sat and watched the whole thing. Got to chat with them all. It was a really good time. And plus, Zeshin, the host of it all, says win or lose. Um, you're free to sit and, you know, watch the tournament and stuff. You don't have to, you won't get kicked off. So no matter what, whether I won or lost, I get to, I can watch the rest of the tournament. Which is good. Um, but yeah, if, I, I can't remember the name of my opponent right now. But... When you see the footage, you can try and take a guess. Think who do you think won? Who do you think I managed to succeed in beating my opponent? I forget what his name is, but he's he was previously in the tournament. Like he's done it before, so he's not it's not his first time. For me, I'm player two. It's our first time. Three eleven crafts been it once before, so you know you can look at the experience factor in this. But you know who do you think won? Who do you think won? Do you think I won my fate? Do you think player two won his fate? Go and cast your votes. How much faith he's got in me? But anyway, guys, so welcome back to Naruto. I'm back into this world. Um. I actually have stuff I want to do today. Now, I've tried the flight ability. Now, I actually... Good good job comment section. He's actually thought of a few really good ideas for how to possibly... It's work things that I never would have thought of. So someone suggested, or two people suggested, um, why don't you try using all your chakra and then flying with it as well? Well, I tried that. It, it doesn't work. Flight doesn't work with that. Then you suggested take the Naruto mod out. That may be what's conflicting with it. It probably is. I tried that. It still didn't work. No joke, I took the Naruto mod out, I tried using flight, no, just nothing changed, I just still couldn't do anything, I just couldn't double jump anymore. <laughs> so, something has cursed me so I can't use my wind style and take flight, something is holding me back on my wind style, I don't know what it is, but something doesn't want me using the damn thing, which is a real damn pain. By the way, um, before I get into anything else with that, I first of all want to find the right sack that I'm holding the things I'm looking for in. Um, I wanted to put on our, make our sacrifice. And I want to summon the nature guardian once more. I think, why? Why would you want to summon him again? Because um, I want his scythe. The more or less is the story around it. I want, I want his scythe off him. And I want more red points. So I'm going to summon him once more. I'm going to kill him. Uh, I've not got a notch apple this time, so I'm going to have to try and kill him without that. So that'll be fun. Um, yeah, we'll see how this goes. Alright, now I've got my weapons and stuff. As long as I stay inside this thing, or if I can get him to move inside this thing, I should be good. I right, also big thank you to everyone for last episode. Episode 30 did insanely well. It's not even been 24 hours yet. It was already on... Well, it's past 800 views at this point. It's got over 150, around 160 likes in the 24 hours, which is absolutely insane. So that's like a new record. Um, I think that is actually the record for the most likes I've had in one day. Yes, I just, I just went and checked it now. About 158 likes. It's been 23 hours at this point, so it's not even been 24 yet. I'll check what the final score is, but I think you've about done yourselves. So I don't know how and if you're going to top that, but I'm going to leave the like go for this video at 75, since we pretty much broke beyond that by a long way. So, leave the like go for that this video, and let's summon the thing again. Oh, 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 one more thing. I'm Violet, who's actually on server, and she said she found a village, so I can go kidnap children, and I can go and summon the life guardian. And all that stuff. So I'll, I'll see if I can get her and do that later on. Or I'll do it next episode. But anyway, for the meantime, let's let's kill another one of these guys. Hello, back. Uh, we're back again. We're back here again. <laughs> He's going to hate me by the end of this. Anyway, yeah, as long as I stay inside this thing, it's going to be a pretty easy fight. I know he does some damage to me now and then, but he really... He really doesn't do enough. Plus, but as long as I'm inside this thing, he hasn't got a chance. He's a really tough boss. He would wreck me, probably, if I was out there fighting by myself. Because it does recommend a magic level of like 60 to fight him, but, you know. While I've got this little strat here, he's, he's got nothing. Plus, he's already seen me fight him, so I don't really feel like he's need to see me fight him again. So I'll probably skip a lot of the fight for this. But I've got something else really interesting planned. Because I've got, I've got an idea on how maybe I can fix this curse on my flying ability. Okay, you get a bit too chancy. I just tried jumping out at him. Um, then suddenly I just noticed I'm losing a lot of hearts. Yeah, I, pro I probably don't want to be out here. But here I am, out here. All right, I reckon I can take him out before he takes me out. Oh, I know I can definitely take him out. Not a hole. 
Gotcha. What do I get? Red Infinity Orb. Jump up. Please tell me I got a scythe. No scythe. Damn it. Oh, that's the love heart. It means I've got to try and find more girls and fight them again. God damn it. At least I got a new Infinity Orb. So I can unlock something new with that. Which is good. Because I'm going to need it for what I've got planned next. It's going to be fun. Really love it. I'm really digging the battle armor for the fact that it regens itself. It really it eats out my chakra to regenerate it, but it's well worth it. Plus, I've got tons of chakra. Right, so I've got this one here. So in order to unlock damage, I need to unlock beam next, which is something I did want greatly. Uh, I've also got speed though. Speed is something I'm always into because I love having a lot of speed. Um, it's ability zone. I don't know what that does. I think that just creates the thing around you. Contingency health. Um, I believe, yep, there's a healing one here that's really good. Costs a lot of chakra for healing jutsus, but well worth it again. Duration's another good one I want, which is really far away, so we won't plan on that one anytime soon. Um, and then there's these contingencies and stuff, but that's not too interesting, I'd say. Yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go with beam. It's a lot easier than suggesting beam attacks anyway, so I feel that's probably the best thing to add. So there we go, I've got, I've got unlocked beam, so now I can make... Well, beam attacks. So, who I can make a new lightning jutsu with that. Let's try that. Let's make a new lightning jutsu with the beam ability. I feel like it would be more effective once damage is on, but you know. It's fine now, right? So we've got beam. Got lightning damage. And is there anything else I want to add to it just while I'm at it? I know this is how the thing exploded last time, but I am thinking, what else can I do to annoy them? I think Entangle. Entangle is one that I do enjoy using because it uh, paralyzes them. Or actually, no, blindness. Ah, Lightning Jutsus are so useful because I can play with the nerve system so well. I feel like Entangle is better though because if I hit them once, they won't be able to move and I can just keep hitting them. So, no problem is it's going to cost a huge amount of chakra doing this. So, I've got Lightning Style. It's a good one for a beam attack. Lightning style dragon roar. I could like go with that. Let's go with that. So, booking quilt. Finalized. Beautiful. Right. Let's try this. Let's quickly. Okay, so I just crashed. Um, yep, server's good. Alright, so I, I didn't know what just happened there, but okay. Give me that book. Got that. That was a Winstell book and it made me crash. What were the odds of Winstell making me do that? <laughs> it's a shame too because I've got quite a lot of Winstell power in me. Right. Anyway, let's get the show on the road. So, Lightning Steel Dragon Roar. Obviously, now that I've got I'm unlocking more things, you just can start suggesting more ideas for me as well. I'm totally open to that. You can come up with some good ones. Just remember that there is a limit to what I can combine with what because if I combine too much, of certain things, the thing will explode like it did when I tried to make the Rasengan. So you need to try and limit how many you put in a thing or make sure they're all around the same area. Like they're all around the same kind of element. Alright, so I'm assuming that's a redstone thing that I need. There we are. What? I need some of that stuff. Oh god. How do I make the purple powder again? Right, I need that, 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 and that. So Desert Nove. Right, okay, that's fine. There we are. Purified Ventium Dust. One of those flowers, easy peasy, because I've got tons of them now, because I went off traveling. Um, that's got nothing in it, it's empty. It only ever does one jutsu and it runs out. Lucky I've, I went and got tons of buckets before. They're running out though. Oh, I need to link it again as well, don't I? Damn it! I forget I need to do this every single time I make one of these. Right, boom, that's linked. Then, yep, yeah, there we go. Oh god, I need a slime ball, don't I? Pretty sure I've got some in the house. I hope I've got some. Alright, Entangle's one of those ones where I'm going to have very little supplies for us because getting slime balls is never easy in Minecraft. Yeah, I've got nine in there. Perfect. Because, yeah, I don't spend a lot of time in swamps. I'm not Shrek. I don't go to swamps very often. I don't know. It'd be good if there's a village hidden in the swamps. I could go to them for slime balls, but, you know, there's no such thing so far. Alright, last thing. Spell parchment and boom. We've got ourselves a brand new Jutsu. I believe there's a perfect picture for this. I'd say it's that one. Right. So, let's make sure this... Yep, it's named correctly. Oh my god, that looks cool. That looks so cool! 
And it doesn't drain too much at a time. That is that is freaking awesome. It's half nature, half lightning. I like that. Right, okay, let's try this on someone. If this paralyzes opponents and shocks them, this is gonna be something really deadly. <laughs> Hello, Creeper. Right, it's got short range. That's fine. Wow, that does a lot of damage. That does a bit as much as my lightning still static shock. Only it keeps going. And it stops our movement. And it's really cheap. Dudes, dudes, dudes. I think, I think we've just advanced in our jutsus quite a bit. Anyone tries to mess with us, boom. Lightning to the face. You can't move because you're paralyzed due to the lightning going through your body. And you're getting shocked to death very slowly. I feel like this is a jutsu that's a win-win. I feel like we've been into something incredible. But I want to hear your guys' ideas. Because now that I'm unlocking more, I can go fight that guardian more and more. I want to steal these blocks to see what they are. Wait, I just got a speed boost. Derf. What are you? Violet? What have you done? What has she made? She's made something incredible anyway. But yeah, I want to hear your guys' ideas for Jutsus. Obviously, I can keep fighting the Guardian and get more and more stuff off him. So, got no problems there. I can keep getting more stuff as time goes. But I want to hear some ideas for different Jutsus and cool names that can come up with them. Um, on top of the usual stuff. Now, I know everyone's been saying, can you please start adding more clans into the book? Believe me, I am doing it bit by bit. But it's just one of those things. It's because there was so many before, it's going to take a little bit of update it all. And generally, it takes a lot of time for me to add them in myself because I've got to hand write them all in because I can't just copy and paste a lot of the time because it's got limited the book's a lot smaller like the page is not that big when you'll really look at it so you know I need to normally adapt it to make it work better but you know I do I'm adding the stuff in as it goes and I'll just reveal it all as to, when the time comes wow I feel really sorry for the guys on the other end of this all right anyway so the other thing I wanted to do today because I wasn't just planning to I made you all with my new Dragon Roar Lightning Style Jutsu. Um, I actually have another boss I want to fight because... Now, I believe I'm cursed at this point because I don't understand why I've kept... If, I, I just can't use Wind Style properly. So I believe this is all to do with something cursed me from the sky. So I'm going to fight against the Sky Demon today. And I will take his power. Right, so in order to summon the Sky Demon... Now, he's a bit of a music lover himself... Oh yeah, I better put the jutsu in here, I think. Probably be a good idea. So, alright. So that pretty much replaces static pulse and everything. I suppose static pulse is good for disarming people, but this one's just freaking awesome. Right, now for this, I'm going to need some special stone to summon it. Which, just remember, I think it's just stone and a diamond in the middle, yep. Then, to make it, his name's Hyus Wu. Uh, I believe he's a Chinese god. But, either, or he's a demon, more like, not really a god. But, yeah, right, so I get that. Get four of them, get bone. Then I surround it in diamond and note blocks. He's a bit of a music lover himself. Violet left. All right, I guess I'm not asking her about the village today then. All right, so I'm going to need some redstone. I'm going to need some wood. I'm going to need some diamonds. And I'm going to need some stone. So let's get on it. Oh, god. Right, I only, I only need four diamonds. No, I need eight, okay. I've, I've nearly ran out of diamonds. I'm going to have to go bargain with someone to get more diamonds. Maybe Turkey if she comes back on in a while. I can try and bargain with her because she's got stacks. All she does is go mining and then play with lucky blocks. She doesn't care about diamonds. Anyway, right. So I need stones. I'll have to go get that in a minute. I need four note blocks, which I believe is just this. One, two, three, four. Right, I need... I'm going to need a bow in a minute as well, but that's fine. Right, let's go get some stone. Right, then take... All that. Then we need a bone. I believe I should have one lying around somewhere. Yep, there's one. One bone. Then we've got that. Then we surround that in diamonds and nope, nope blocks. A little bit around. Boom. Hughes was summoning plate, and it's active. Right now we do actually get some quite good stuff out of this guy if we do beat him. So I may want to clear up my inventory a bit first, but yeah, this is going to be a really interesting fight. I wanted to fight him when I had, like, Henry or something to take his, like, so he was distracted. I wanted some help. I wanted some support when doing this. Because this guy is, he's pretty tough. I'm going to be honest, he is pretty tough. 
Alright, I believe that's all the space I'm going to need. Let's take them over to the battlegrounds in the back. Okay, something I've been thinking of for a while now. Would anyone think, you think it's worth me building a wall around this place? I mean, I'm not particularly sure myself if it is worth it because, to be honest, that section round over there is the sea. Just beyond those mountains, it's the sea. And the same with the side there, there's mostly just the sea. Then, yeah, fair enough, there's lots of stuff around there. And there's a river here. So I, I don't know if it's worth trying to break it all off and build like a giant wall around everything. But I, it'd be a lot of work and I need to start, I do want to start live streaming more. I've just been really busy the last few days. There's some stuff, like I had the Dragon Block C event today. I had some stuff on yesterday. It's just, it stops me from live streaming a lot of the time during the day. Which is a bad thing. <sighs> right. Now I forget how strong this guy is. I haven't ever really fought him before. I've only heard rumours, but let's do it. Hello? Where? Did I just get ripped off of eight diamonds? I'm not sure. No, it's the server's crashed. Crap! Okay. Right, so apparently it doesn't want to be summoned. Um. Bit of a predicament there. Because, as per usual, whenever we try to do anything related to the wind, or the air, or um, wind style jutsus, anything along those lines, naturally, we're just cursed and we can't do it. Which is really annoying. <laughs> it is really damn annoying. Ah. God damn it. Well, what am I going to do now? I, mean, I could try again, but I reckon it'll just crash again. Yeah. Yeah, it's crashed again. Damn it! Alright, well all I know now is that this thing has to be destroyed. Or I could take it apart. I've not tried the uncrafting table yet. Let's give that a go. Let's get my stuff back. Because it seems like I've wasted this quite a bit. Put that there. There we are. Got my stuff back. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to get much more than that. Because this thing is expensive for levels. But Oh no, I, can't, I could just take it back. Whatever. I will fight him someday. I just I just don't know when. Oh, and, Vi and Violet's went off too, so I can't even ask her for the coordinates for the village. And go kidnap some children. This leaves me in a very sad place, because now I don't know what to do for the rest of the episode. Give me a minute. As per usual. Another day. A failed wind-style, wind-related instant. That's, that's becoming my thing now, I just can't do wind-style. That's just just my thing now. I'm, I'm as well just sticking to lightning still and accepting that is what I'm stuck with. God damn it, being cursed with just being able to shoot lightning bolts from my hands. What a terrible fate. Or maybe I should look into doing a new jutsu. Alright, someone suggested um, a war style jutsu actually. Um, for basically the water prison jutsu. Water style water prison. Um, I believe for it you need summon water. Which is a utility. So, where is it? Yeah, create water. It's a green one. Um, so combine that with, I think, watery grave, and drown. And I believe at that point there, you've now got yourself a winner for water. Still, unfortunately, even if I use it, it's not gonna not gonna do very much. I need I need more damage and things. But you know, I could create it just to give it a go, just to see what it's like. But I need a green one first. So to do that, I need to fit against one of the more difficult bosses, which I believe the Air Guardian's always a good one. So let's go fight, give him a little bash. I'll just create a water still, dude. So that's what I'll do. Make up for the fact I can't do wind still. I'll compensate. Well, that's a good chance to actually test the the Dragon Roar Jutsu. All right, someone was fighting him recently. Who's this? Of course, it's Henry. Why do I even ask who it is? It's obviously Henry. Right, let's do this. Let's try this again. There we are. Freeze! Think I'm gonna run at a chakra before he runs at health? No. No, my chakra's holding up quite well. I, I can seriously do this. I can seriously just hold this on him and kill him with this. Right, hold on, no, wait, stop. Right, get him! Nice. So, there's our infinity orb. Beautiful. 
just quickly. Oh god, that was nearly a shatter on on something valuable there. We Okay, so utility. We've got create water. Right. So I wanna make this one area of effect. But I'll need to make a projectile. So projectile, area of effect. Then we want let's see. What watery Right, we want create water first. Then watery grave. And then they'll probably be able to escape this. I mean, entangle might be interesting. Let's stick entangle in there. And then drown. This is a water prison jutsu then. Still got a few books left. Smashing. Right, so water still, water prison. Let's see if we can make this one work. Need to keep this one safe. That's actually quite a good one. Right. Let's see if we can make this. And parchment. Here we are. We're finished. I thought it was going to be a lot longer than what it was. I'll be honest. Alright. Water still, watery grave. So, I believe we want something watery looking for this one. Which I have no clue what that would be. Uh, I think... Water style, that looks, that works, okay. Here we are. Right. I don't, I don't know where the create water is. And he's not really taking any damage. I've just created a new paralysis jutsu. Oh god. I've created a thing where they can't move. Where they think they're in water. But they're not. Oh god, no, there's the water. It just, it had a bit of a delayed effect, okay. But there's no drowning involved here. This is an issue. Alright, I need, I need to boost the power of this then. So I've got what I've got this so now I can create water. And I can paralyze them. But they don't drown. Which is annoying. I, I really do want them to drown. Alright, this is going to create a mess. Alright, well it does work. It just doesn't work as well as I wanted it to. I wanted to create like a sphere or something around them, but I guess beggars can't be choosers. I've still got to master my water style. I'm not very good at it. But you know, it's it's a working progress. But anyway, as for how I'm going to get inside the building, boom, body flicker. Alright guys, well I'm going to end this episode here, so thank you very much for watching. As I said before, I'm going to leave the like goal at 75 likes for this video, so... I mean, obviously he's could try and beat the record if he's want, because at the moment it's sitting at 158 likes, and... Well, it's not even been 24 hours yet, but 158 likes in 24 hours. If you guys want to try and beat that, go for it, but the like goals will be 75, so, you know, hit that in next episode. Boom. But I've got complete confidence. He's, he's doing it easily every day anyway. But anyway, yes, yeah, so unfortunately our curse for the wind still continues. I still can't do anything wind-related, apparently, without causing explosions and crashing things, so that's fun. I'll need to go over that someday. Uh, but on the plus side, I made a brand new lightning style jutsu that is insanely powerful, so Henry's going to have a fun time when he meets that. Same with player 2 when I see him again, I need to show him that one. See what he says to that, because paralyzing the opponent, how awesome is that? And plus, I can just hold them there and keep blasting them, and it'll keep laying on the entanglement, it's brilliant. Anyway, um, yeah, keep suggesting ideas for everything. Keep suggesting ideas for the village, keep suggesting ideas for clans, just as much... Ideas for everything, ideas for jutsus, lay them on me, because I do read all the comments. It does take me a while sometimes, because there's quite a few of them, but I do read them all. Um, but anyway guys, thank uh, again, also apologies for the episode being late, it's just because of the Dragon Block C event. Everything should be normal tomorrow, tomorrow's episode should go up at the usual time, which is 7 o'clock Eastern time? Midnight my time? It's around that, I think. Anyway, thank you all for watching, I'll see you all next time tomorrow, by that I mean. Um, goodbye everybody.